Fun fact about me, I didn't want to vlog because I had hair up under my chin. Oh God, when we first started, when we first started YouTube, I did not want to vlog anymore. I mean, I did not want to vlog because I had hair up under my chin. Now, looking like a whole schnitnack. What y'all see that man? I hope he alright. That was looking like he was done. Is is out. Yo! Yo! You alive? What the hell happened? Huh? What happened? Was that you in there laid out? What's up y'all, it's your girl Nick G, the host, and welcome to the vlog. Do y'all know this is my sixth time attempting to do a vlog? See, the issue is, I simply just don't know how to vlog. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people are like, yo, Nick, you need to vlog. Vlogging should be your thing. I want to see your day. I want to show you my day. But I, 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 I got to show you like the Jake Paul Logan <clears throat> vlogs way. You know what I'm saying? DDG way. Not born ass neat way. That's just whack. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to give y'all no whack shit. You know what I'm saying? I simply just want to get y'all fire ass content. I had to, um, I'm changing my sheets right now. You know what I'm saying? Doing my laundry. You know what I'm saying? Doing grown woman shit. You know? Since I don't have a woman living with me no more. You know what I'm saying? So I got to do my thing. But, um, what I'm gonna do this morning is show y'all what I do in the morning. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I think we can start off with that. I think that's a good start. I think that's a good start. So, um, let me go put on some shorts. Um, cause y'all probably gonna see my drawers. <laughs> we perfect. What happens when you, come on bitch. That's what happens when you got a little camera. You know what I'm saying? And, um, a little drop. <laughs> Hence is why that's what I purchased. <laughs> but, uh, all right, so this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna show y'all my morning routine. You know what I'm saying? That's how we're gonna start this vlog off. Uh, and that's what we're gonna do. Normally you do morning routines to make them funny and shit, not in a funny mood. Yeah, so <laughs> what I'm gonna do is show y'all what I do in the morning, the products I use, <clears throat> things like that. So first we're gonna start off with Lucida. Lucida is a charcoal whitening toothpaste that we sell at TLC. You know, and before we get into the whole these products thing, because mostly I only use TLC products, I want to be very clear with this message. I stand for my people. I stand for what's right with our people. Um, however, we are freelance in this company. So you have people that are pretty much contractors. They can buy products, sell them. You know what I'm saying? You have your own website, shit like that. But this company is not based around one person. So, with that being said, I still stand by these products because these products simply just changed my life. So, you know what I'm saying? I don't have any beef with the products, you know? But I don't stand for what other people stand for and I never have and I never will because I'm my own person. So, I stand for us, I rock with us forever. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I will continue to use these products because these products have me 45 pounds down. They, I, I damn near don't have one blemish on my face and they are just simply great products. So when a product is good, you can stand by it. It's okay, you know what I'm saying? When you go to the hospital, if they say something wrong at the hospital, guess what? You still need that service. So I'm gonna still continue to use my products. Now, let's start. So this is Lucida. Lucida is a charcoal whitening toothpaste. And uh, let me give y'all a song while I brush my breath. I just wanna run up them bands. Fuck trying to make fucking friends. Niggas don't see through my lens. Let me tell you about the shit. Boy, I couldn't even pay my rent. Not on some dumb shit. Really on some bum shit. What you know about check to check? Bill collectors at my neck. Now the secret. <clears throat> the secret to my face being so damn clean is A because I detox. I detox with CBD ISOT. Okay? CBD ISOT detoxes out your kidney, colon, um, liver, intestines, all of your inside parts. You know what I'm saying? 
but also I use Rejuve. Now Rejuve is a face spray. It cleans out your face, but it has CBD in it. You know what I'm saying? Um, so normally I just spray myself with it, but I'm gonna spray it on a, a paper towel today. One thing about doing this, one thing about promoting is you have to promote on all of your platforms. So this is gonna be a lot of editing, but it's all right. Spray my paper towel with it. Wipe my face off. With CBD in it, you dig? This link is in my bio as well. Y'all make sure y'all cop that. Now for those who will probably claim that they don't get hair, they don't get hair to grow up under their chin, they not telling the truth. You get hair. <laughs> okay, okay, maybe not. Everybody don't get hair up under their um, chin. I do. And although I dress like a man, that don't have nothing to do with me wanting to look like one with hair. I don't want no hair. So I do something called dermablading. Dermablading helps get rid of the hair up on the edge and on your face. And it also helps you get rid of dry skin. You can either go down or up. Going up gets rid of the dead skin. I'm lying, going down gets rid of the dead, no. Going down gets rid of the hair. Going up gets rid of the dead skin. I was told to use vitamin E oil, because first I was doing this bare face, um, and I was told that I need to use vitamin E oil you know what I'm saying, to make sure I don't fuck up my damn face. So the LED light helps you see what all the hair is off, or the skin. And when you go up, when you go up, that's when you see that hair. Truthfully, I just be, I just be doing it. Um, It's never rules with shit that I do, which it should be, because you know, you don't, <laughs> you don't wanna mess up your face or, you don't want to um, mess up nothing. But uh, I don't. I just, um, some things I just, you know, I feel like it's common damn sense. And I'm really a hands-on person. So if I see it one time, I can do it for the most part. Um, Y'all see that little piece right there? I'm so glad she told me to get this oil. Cause I was doing it with nothing. Somebody was cringing. I was going to the side. And I'm a hairy, hairy person. So this is why I dermablade. For those that wanna know. I, why do you do that? I'm hairy as hell. And I don't like it. I simply just don't like it. But you can't help how you was born. A lot of us like to complain and gripe about what's going on with us. And I promise you, you can change it. You can change whatever it is. You can change whatever it is. It is Get Fine Saturdays, baby. Fun fact about me. I didn't want to vlog because I had hair up under my chin. Oh God, when we first started, when we first started YouTube, I did not want to vlog anymore. I mean, I did not want to vlog because I had hair up under my chin. Now, looking like a whole schnenek. My barber took care of my forehead yesterday. <laughs> and my hair is actually growing back I used to stress a lot. I used to stress about other people. And of course my shit, but I used to uh, take other people's shit and put it on me too. Um, and my hair 
stop growing on the sides. As y'all know, I've had issues with my lineup, with bald spots in my lineup. Damn. Sometimes it should look good, sometimes it don't. But it's okay. Cause by the end of this year, it's gonna be looking way better. My homie got some um some cream that's gonna help my hair grow. The Wave God, my she's actually my barber. Royal Wave God butter. So um I'm gonna be putting this on my sides. You know what I'm saying? And uh if y'all want to shop with her, the link will be in the description. But I'm gonna make a journey of that too. So that's also for your skin as well. But yeah, we've been in the bathroom entirely too long. See that? Mm -hmm. Y'all wonder why my face looks so good. I've been taking care of that damn face, baby. Facts. So I take a Nutriburst shot every morning. I do it on Instagram, and I also take my NRG. Now, one thing about this Nutriburst, this Nutriburst that saves my life as well. This is what keeps a smile on my face. <laughs> um, it has 72 minerals in it. Hold on. What's up, y'all? So I'm vlogging, right? The camera's over there. And um, I'm telling them about the products you need. And I'm over here getting excited because I just, Took care of my face, you know what I'm saying? But it looks so good on this camera though. Mm -mm. But anyway, so I take a shot of Nutriburst every day. And my NRG. NRG is an energy supplement, hence NRG. Say energy fast, which is NRG. Um, it gives you energy, literally. And it has something in it called 5 HTP that sends positive signals to your brain. And I talk about that mostly, more than I talk about any other any other thing that it does, um, simply because we all need positive vibes. We all need positive vibes going to the brain. You know what I'm saying? So, yes sir. It sends uh, positive signals to your brain and it's called 5-HTP. I encourage you to look it up, you know what I'm saying? It's a really, really, really good time, okay? And I gotta learn how to keep my head in this, damn. We all need positive vibes to the brain, especially at a time like this. I love my NRG the most. And it also curbs your appetite as well. Um, for those that need energy, want their appetite curved and all that. Now, you do not have to, you don't have to take this off, but I take it off, because I want it to go to my bloodstream faster, so. Mm-hmm. About to drink the Nutriburst. Then I take my shot of my Nutriburst. And then I start my day. Now that's how you make a vlog. I'm about to go work out. I'll see both of y'all later on in the day. Both of you. I love you all. <laughs> if you need any of these products, please uh, hit the link in the description. It has all the products. I will type in the vitamin E oil and uh, the dermablading thing. I got it from Walmart. Y'all should be able to go to Walmart and find it. It's very simple. But other than that, that's all I got to say for right now. Um, I'm gonna work out and then we're gonna start this day. You did. We blogging today. Oh, bitch, we blogging today. Eventually. All right, y'all. So, um. I just put a, I just put me on a little shirt or whatever, some shorts. I'm about to go to the gun range. I said that I was gonna go to the gun range yesterday, um, to, that I was gonna go today and I forgot. Um, so yeah, I'm definitely gonna go get off some of that gun power, that gun smoke, you know what I'm saying? Get this shit popping. But yeah, that's gonna be my vlog today. That's what I'm doing today. You dig? And that's what I'm doing. I don't know. I don't know how to vlog. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to say. I don't know. I'm leaving. Bye. What's up, y'all? So, the gun range is a dub. Damn, the gun range is a dub. You gotta be a member. But anyway, I got this shirt recently. 
from the mall. And um, they didn't take the damn, this thing off. And I tried to burn it, cause I heard if you burn it, you could pull it off. That ain't happened, so. I'm about to take this bitch back real fast. But other than that, that's a dub. So, what I'm gonna do? What I'm gonna do? What I'm gonna do? I'm supposed to film my homies at um, this cookout they having for uh, all the lesbians in Atlanta. But that's that ain't till three. So that's, that's whack. That's real whack. Oh, I gotta wait for that. But uh oh, till then, let me hurry up and get my ass in this mall. So, for those who don't know, I get real weird when I'm filming and people are staring at me. It's something that I really, really don't like because why are you staring at me? A, get out of my face. But B, it's a camera, it's not a gun. You know what I'm saying? People just look weird and maybe it's because uh, I'm talking to a camera, but either way, I gotta be a vlogger. I gotta be about that vlog life. My boy out there. So yeah, let me get this shit out. Something wrong. Dude laid out. Let me zoom this shit. Damn. trying to take it off and now she said I could take it off with two forks that is so whack she should have took it off in the first place but anyway yeah I'm about to get up out of here because I ain't buying nothing because I'm on a uh what you call it? since I moved I'm on a little I'm on a spending diet I guess let's call it a budget what I don't know what y'all see that man. I hope he alright. But yeah, I'm on a spending diet. You know what I'm saying? Oh, here come the ambulance. That's crazy. Every time you record and you see something, they just walk in the hell like the man ain't dying. <laughs> Walking in here slow as hell. Man, going through some shit. I pray he get through it. I don't know what's going on. I pray he get through it. But yeah, y'all. I gotta, uh. I'm mad about that shirt. But my stupid ass shouldn't have touched it. I should have just brought it back. But she should have just took it out. But anyway, I'm about to go to Academy so I can get me some weights if I can find some. Give me some weights and I need to get something to eat. Like, I'm hungry, but I'm, I'm not. But I want to eat something. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. Come on, water. Yo, the n that was looking like he was done is is out. Yo! Yo! You alive? What the hell happened? Huh? What happened? W was that you in there laid out? It wasn't you. I'm sorry. You got a twin in there. You got a twin in there. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I ain't shit. He, that wasn't even him. <laughs> so I just had a um, sandwich from Firehouse Subs. I ain't want to show y'all that because, you know, I ain't supposed to be eating a sandwich. <laughs> but anyway, the cookout I'm going to today, I was just going to throw on that shirt, but I don't even feel like playing with it to be real. So I'm about to buy me a jersey. Um, I've been wanting a jersey for a minute. So I'm about to buy me a jersey real fast. And um, I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna go back to the, no, I'm gonna go to Academy. One thing about being in Atlanta, everything is long, bro. <clears throat> the lines are long. To drive somewhere is long. To park is long. To everything is long, okay? So um, yeah, I'm about to go back in this mall real fast, go get this jersey. And yes, yeah, sir, I'll see y'all when I get back in the car. <laughs> What's up, y'all? So, it's still the same day. Um, I know I suck. I suck at vlogging. I don't even know what to say. So, I just had to make me a shirt real fast. You know what I'm saying? Um, I had to handle that. This is a shirt that I made by any means necessary. You did. Y'all already know what it is. 
Also, um, and I gotta stop saying, um, like, get it together. Also, I got a jersey. I got a New York um, baseball jersey, and I got a 2X. I'm not fat no more. But I'm not that fat anymore. I'm not as fat as I used to be. You know what I'm saying? So, I gotta go back to the mall, but I'm not going today. I am about to put on my clothes and head out the door. And I'm gonna show y'all my finished product with me looking like a schnick. You dig what I'm saying? So let's do that. Need to put a cover on my bed before I leave, but I don't feel like it, so I'm not. But um, I don't look half bad, you know what I'm saying? Feet, you know, y'all know I keep a good feet. The Nike, you know what I'm saying? So, um, that's what we about to do. We about to hit this cookout, man, or this park, whatever. I, don't, I ain't even look at the flyer, <laughs> but we about to do that. You dig? And get sexy, you know what I'm saying? You never know, I might find my wife. Just kidding. <laughs> y'all, it's this dude riding around on a bike. And his big ass dog loose. Y'all know I was scared as hell. But um, all right, y'all finally made it to the park, but I'm late. I had to get something to eat. I had an attitude. I can't not eat. If I don't eat, I'm gonna have an attitude. I and mean, that's just that on that. You know, I think it's a black woman thing. You know what I'm saying? Truly. I think it's truthfully a black woman thing. You know what I'm saying? But it it is what it is. Call me what you want. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm about to go here and see what's popping. People leaving apparently. You know, so I'm gonna just show up fashionably late. People who are ready to step outside the parameters of professionalism because we gotta show kids you don't have to look like a white person. You don't have to buy into that white supremacy view of what professionalism is. So if you are interested, please hit me up. Thank you. Damn, I missed the whole shit.